Rocksteady Studios has been long rumored to be working on a new project for the past two or three years. During this period, the developer was said to be either chalking out plans for Superman or the new Justice League. However, it turns out that Rocksteady Studios may perhaps be revisiting Gotham City with a new installment called Batman Arkham Universe. There is obviously no official confirmation on the subject, but a supposed whistleblower recently dropped a long list of details for what to expect. Hi, I'm Wes Malik from Segment Next, and here are 10 important things to know about Batman Arkham Universe. Since everything is based on rumors at this point, remember to take it all with a dash of salt. It concludes the franchise. There have been four main installments in the Batman Arkham franchise in the last decade, three of them being spearheaded by Rocksteady Studios. Batman Arkham Universe is said to be the last one from the developer. But this doesn't confirm that others like Warner Brothers can't step in to take the reins for further takes. The plot follows the Court of Owls. Batman Arkham Universe will be based on the magnificent comic book series penned by Scott Snyder, which means that the chief antagonist will be an organized crime syndicate that has been controlling Gotham City from the shadows for centuries. In the source materials, Batman was completely overwhelmed by the court and its members nearly dying at their hands at one point. The threat grew even stronger when it was revealed that the secret society has an army of bred assassins who sleep in an inner sanctum until called upon by their masters. Fully Playable Bat Family The threat of annihilation in Batman Arkham Universe will bring out the entire Bat Family in Gotham City. Besides the Dark Knight, the other playable characters are going to be Robin, Nightwing, Batgirl, Batwoman, Catwoman, and Red Hood. This roster will be able to fully roam and explore and not be restricted to just a few missions. Most of these cape characters have already been established in previous installments. Rocksteady Studios has to just expand on their moves and abilities. Visiting the Batcave In similar fashion to previous installments in the series, Batman Arkham Universe will have a fully functioning Batcave that serves as the main hub for weapons, upgrades, modes, and missions. This rocky sanctum will also be where players can swap their characters from one member of the Bat family to another. New Enemies to Deal With The rise of the Court of Owls will introduce new and dangerous enemies in Batman Arkham Universe. The first type will be Talons, who are said to be the same as the ninjas from Batman Arkham Knight. They'll be armed with their own gadgets such as throwing knives and having the skill to counter counters. The second type will be pilots, who are said to be similar to the Sable Task Force in Spider-Man. They hover the battlefield and can only be taken down through gadgets. Living Breathing Gotham Batman Arkham Universe will rectify a common problem that has often been raised for each of the past installments. The fact is that Gotham City has always been empty and devoid of any human activity. Rocksteady Studios will make amends by building a living and breathing city that will not only show life, but also be nearly twice in scale to Batman Arkham Knight. In addition, there'll be an option to set the time of day from morning to dusk or night. The weather will be dynamic as well, featuring rain and snow. Random Crimes to Solve There will be plenty to do in Batman Arkham Universe. The bustling Gotham City will be full of side activities to indulge in. This ranges from foiling bank robberies to taking out muggers and from chasing down suspects to solving murders. Redesign Batmobile and new Bat Cycles The first thing to note is that the Batmobile will be restricted to just transport in Batman Arkham Universe. There'll be no missions to use it as a battering ram or rampaging tank. Secondly, every member of the Bat family will get access to Bat Cycles. In that light, the Batcave could possibly allow players to swap between the two transport vehicles. Multiplayer Modes Batman Arkham Universe could possibly have a separate multiplayer mode. This would be incredibly surprising because Rocksteady Studios has always shied away from online activities for The Dark Knight. Batman Arkham Origin was the only entry in the franchise to have an online cooperative mode and that installment was developed by Warner Brothers. Platforms and release date Batman Arkham Universe is currently in development for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC. 
There will also be an enhanced edition for PlayStation 4 Pro and Xbox One X. The new installment in the franchise is slated for a worldwide release in fall 2019. This means that Rocksteady Studios should be dropping a teaser trailer in the coming months. What do you make of Batman Arkham Universe? Let us know in the comments below.